how to solve square root 5 minus 12 i so I solved this question is the method so first method let square root 5 minus 12 i is equal to x minus i y then I can say here is square root 5 minus 12 i is equal to x minus i y I just use both side whole square then I can say here is square root is cancelled so we are find out here is 5 minus 12 i is equal to x square minus 2 x y i plus i square y square because of that we know that a minus b whole square is equal to x square minus 2 a b plus b square then it will be 5 minus 12 i is equal to x square and look here is i square it will be minus 1 so minus 1 times y square it will be y square minus 2 x y i then if i compare the real part and imaginary part this time i can say here is x square minus y square is equal to 5 and here is 2 x y is equal to 12 here is minus minus cancel then i can say here is y is equal to 12 divide here is twice x then 12 divide 2 it will be 6 so i can say here is easily y is equal to 6 over x then here is x square minus y square is equal to 5 now i put on the value of y in this equation so here is x square minus 6 over x bracket power is 2 is equal to 5 then i can say here is x square minus 6 square it will be 36 over x square is equal to 5 then i can say here is the list value is x square uh, this times this it will be x to the power 4 minus this divide this it will be 1 1 times 36 it will be 36 is equal to 5 then i can say here is x to the power 4 minus 36 5 times x square it will be 5 x square then this equation becomes x to the power 4 minus 5 x square minus 36 is equal to 0 now i do factorization in this equation so now i do middle factor in this equation so this equation becomes x to the power 4 minus 9 x square plus 4 x square minus 36 is equal to 0 look 9 times 4 it will be 36 and 9 minus minus 9 plus 4 it will be minus 5 x square then i can say here is x square is common so this divide this it will be x square minus this divide this it will be 9 plus here is 4 is common so 4 x square divide 4 it will be x square minus 36 divide 4 it will be 9 is equal to 0 then i can say here is x square minus 9 is common so this divide this it will be x square and this divide this it will be plus 4 this 4 is equal to 0 then here is two case first case is x square minus 9 is equal to 0 and others case x square plus 4 is equal to 0 then i can say here is x square is equal to 9 and here is x square is equal to minus 4 then here is square root i use both side square root then i can say here is x is equal to plus minus 3 and here is x is equal to plus minus square root 4 i square because of that i square is minus 1 then it will be x is equal to plus minus 2i now we are find out the value of x is plus 3 and minus 3 and plus 2i and minus 2i now we know that x is equal to plus 3 and x is equal to minus 3 now we are find out the value of y so y is equal to 6 over x so 6 over x this time i can say y is equal to 6 over 
here is 3 so 3 6 divide 3 it will be 2 so I can say easily y is equal to 2 and again when x is equal to minus 3 so we we'll find out y is equal to 6 over x and a 6 over x is minus 3 so I can say it will be minus 2 so when x is equal to 3 this time y is equal to 2 and when x is equal to minus 3 this time y is equal to minus 2 so our equation is x square root 5 minus 12 by is equal to x minus i y look here is then I can say x is equal to when 3 this time y is equal to 2i this i and when x is equal to minus 3 so minus 3 minus 3 minus i y so i y is minus 2 this time I can say here is minus 3 plus 2i so I can say easily our final answer is plus minus 3 minus 2i just I put the value of x now if you calculate this equation in this value so we are find out again same answer look x is equal to plus 2i and x is equal to minus 2i we you know that y is equal to 6 over x now y is equal to 6 over 2i it will be 3 over i because of that 6 divide 2 it will be 3 and again we know that y is equal to 6 over x then I can say here is y is equal to 6 over minus 2i and it will be 3 over i here is minus this minus now I can say our equation is square root 5 minus 12 i is equal to x minus i y when x is equal to 2 i this time y is equal to 3 over i so i i cancel so we'll find out here is 2 i minus 3 and again when x is equal to minus 2 i this time y is equal to minus 3 over i so i i cancel so we we'll find out here is minus 2 i plus 3 because of that minus minus it will be plus so again we we'll are find out same answer look here is 2 i minus 3 and minus 2 i plus 3 and look here is 3 minus 2 i and 2 i minus 3 so answer is again same so our final answer is i can say easily plus minus 3 minus 2i and again I solve this question other method our our question is square root 5 minus 12i then I can say it will be square root 9 minus 12i minus 4 look 9 minus 4 it will be 5 and again I can say here is square root 9 it will be 3 square minus 2 times a a is 3 and here is 2i plus 2i square because of that 2 square it will be 4 and i square it will be minus 1 so 4 times minus 1 it will be minus 4 then I can say here is square root 3 minus 2i bracket power is 2 we know that a square minus 2ab plus b square it will be a minus b whole square then square root is cancel so we'll find out plus minus 3 minus 2i so this is our final answer now I solve this question others method look we'll find out here is x square minus y square is equal to 5 and 2xy is equal to 12 now we know that x square plus y square whole square is equal to x square minus y square bracket power is 2 plus 4 a b so here is 4 x square y square then I can say here is x square minus y square it will be 5 so 5 square plus 2 
x y bracket power is 2 look 2 square it will be 4 x square and here is y square then i can say here is 5 square plus 2 x y it will be 12 so 12 square then i can say here is 25 plus 1 4 4 because of that 12 square it will be 144 and i can say here is square plus y square bracket power is 2 is equal to 169 then i use both side square root so square root is cancelled so we are find out here is x square plus y square is equal to 13 and other equation is x square minus y square is equal to 5 so i can say here is x square minus y square is equal to 5 now if i add both equation so i can say y square is square cancel and here is 2x square is equal to 13 plus 5 it will be 18 then if i divide both side 2 so i can say here is x square is equal to 9 then if i use both side square root so x is equal to plus minus 3 then our equation is x square plus y square is equal to 13 and x square minus y square is equal to 5 now if i subtract both equations so this sign is changing so x square x square cancels so here is 2 y square is equal to 8 and this time i can say here is y square is equal to 4 because of that i divide both side 2 then i can say y square is equal to 4 i use both side square root so we are find out y is equal to plus minus 2 so our first equation is uh, let square root 5 minus 12 i is equal to x minus i y so we are find out the value of a x is equal to plus minus 3 i times y is equal to plus minus 2 then i can say here is plus minus is common this time i can say 3 minus this 2 i so it is our final answer thank you all if you enjoy this video please subscribe my channel